In this video, you will learn how to use custom fields. If you're on a Trello standard, premium, or enterprise plan, you can use this feature. Custom fields are a powerful customization tool for your boards. They allow you to add new field types and custom data to your Trello cards, making them more specific to your workflow. In this video, we'll show you how Sunshine Cakery uses custom fields to easily record details of their cake orders on their Trello cards. This feature will allow them to easily select the occasion, flavors, decoration, and more. Let's create a custom field. First, open a card on your Trello board. Select Custom Fields in the Add to Card section. Then, select New Field. Enter a title for your custom field. A field name can be up to 25 characters in length. Type will specify the type of input that can be entered for the field. This can be set to checkbox, date, dropdown, number, or text. If you select dropdown, you'll have the option to enter the choices for that dropdown. Select create. Let's create another custom field. The text field type adds a text entry field to the card. Once enabled, the field will appear on the front and back of all cards on the board, provided the show field on front of card is checked. Now that we've added a custom field, let's see how we can use it. Select the card you want to edit. You can select any of the custom fields to enter or change the value. Press enter or select the back arrow to save. Need to make changes to your custom field? No problem. You can edit or delete custom fields. Open a card on your Trello board. Select the Custom Fields button on the right-hand side. Select the field you'd like to edit. A pop-up will appear where you can edit or delete options. Note that you cannot change the type of a field once it's created. You can also delete the entire field by selecting Delete Field at the bottom. You can reorder your custom fields to keep your card organized. From the card back, select the Custom Fields button. Select the handle on the left side of the Custom Fields button on the card back, then drag and drop their location in the list. The new arrangements are reflected immediately on all cards on the board. Finally, you can move or copy a card with custom fields to a new board. However, only the fields that have stored values will be moved. If a custom field is empty on a card, that custom field will not copy to the new board. From the card back, select either Move or Copy from the Action section on the right-hand side. Select your destination, list, and position. Then, select Move. Presto, your card, along with all its custom fields with stored values, has been moved. 